Hey, I will be right with you. Yesterday, we said goodbye to some dear friends of ours, one of Sarah's closest friends as they're leaving state, moving out of state. Have you ever uh, asked God, why is this happening now? Or even why is this happening at all? Maybe your question to God is, why did you make me this way? Well, questions for God are only for God to answer, not for me. But those questions, when I ask them, lead me to two places. God is sovereign and God is good. In the book of Isaiah, chapter 55, God says this. And we're going to look at some words and what they mean. In verse 8, God says, For my thoughts are not your thoughts, and your ways are not my ways, says the Lord. The word thoughts in Hebrew indicates God's purposes, God's plans, and God's devices. And the word ways means paths or roads, derech. So let's let's substitute this. For God saying, for my purposes and my plans, my devices, they're not your purposes or your plans. And my roads are not your roads. For as high as the sky is above the earth, my paths are higher than your paths, my roads. And my thoughts, my purposes, and my plans, they're higher than your thoughts. Paul says in the book of Romans, oh, how great God's riches and wisdom and knowledge, how impossible it is for us to understand his decisions and his ways. We know from 1 John 4 that God is love. So the Bible defining the Bible, interpreting the Bible, how do we define the word love if God is love? Well, Paul says again in 1 Corinthians 13, and we know this passage, but remember if God is love and love is patient, then look at it this way. God is patient. God is kind. God is not jealous. God is not boastful. God is not proud, rude, or selfish. He is not easily angered, and he, and he keeps no records of wrongs. Love keeps no records of wrong. God is love. God keeps no records of wrongs. We know that from other verses, right? He remembers our sin no more. God does not gloat over other people's sins, but takes his delight in the truth. God always bears up, always trusts, always hopes, always endures. God loves you. God is sovereign. He has plans and purposes for all of us that are higher than our own ways. So let me play a little bit of this song. I am not skilled to understand What God has willed, what God has planned I only know at His right hand Stands one who is my Savior His word and deed. Christ died to save me this I and in my heart I find the need of him to be my savior that he would leave his place on high and come for sin Higher, he is trustworthy, he is sovereign, and he is good. God bless you.